Hi, it's uh, Lawrence and Gavin, and we're with HydroWorks. Hi, Gavin. Hi, Lawrence. <laughs> okay, um, one of the uh, things we're coming across a lot with lately is chlorine contamination. Um, Gavin, what exactly is that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, chlorine contamination is where um, the water board flushed the pipework with chlorine in order to kill off any bugs after they've done roadworks. Those roadworks could be the point of just replacing water mains, it could be the case where they've been building new houses and adding new um, uh, mains onto and connecting to the mains near your home. If you notice roadworks being done or the water ball changing water mains, the thing to do is to switch and bypass your water softener. If you don't, the result can be almost a deadly termination to your water softener. Some water softeners are easier to repair than others and sometimes the cost can be uh, significant um, just depending on how much damage has been done both to the softener and also to the insulation of the home. There are some circumstances where um, chlorine contamination can, can become quite, uh, quite a problem in a home. So what exactly it is, is this orange stuff, which is effectively water softener resin, is shaped like a marble and it's as hard as a marble and the reason it's so hard is it has a netting around it and that netting effectively um, keeps the uh, resin in the shape round shape of a marble what chlorine does is it breaks away that netting and turns it into jelly and actually as I've got it in my hands here I, I feel like my hands are literally in a bowl of jelly um, once this happens, the effect is a reduction in flow rate and um, the uh, resin can also then break through the risers and break through the uh, screens and into service and then you end up with the orange stuff coming through showers, going into header tanks and as we say, sometimes that can be quite a problem to resolve. So what's the rule of thumb, Gav? The rule of thumb <laughs> shut the water supply. Yeah, to, to shut the water off if um, if there's any any works going on that you know of, or yeah. the, water, the water boards that you know um, via a letter is just to bypass the water softener and switch it off with the main. Yep, good stuff. If in doubt, give us a shout, and we'll come and give you our best advice. Cheers. Thank you.